It is this, this is a long while up today. It is time to meet the skaters here in today's final. Ryan Desenzo coming out of Canada, skating in his first final since 2016. Second line for anyone who's put the full run together, just because you look at those lines, Vincent, Uto, like where are they going to step it up? I'm look I'm at excited. this. Look at this stat. Best SLS finish, fourth place. He's done it numerous times. Ryan Desenzo, thanks to the good folks at Skate Sense for bringing us bringing us the info here this weekend. Desenzo in for his second run. Looked like that time he opted to not try for the half cab crook and just went half cab nose. Yeah, it's something that we talk about a lot when skating contests. How much different is a half cab nose versus a half cab crook really gonna get you? So you might as well just half cab nose slide it. Yeah. Desenzo, Desenzo's the veteran in this group. He's 36 years old. He's been in Street League since 2013. And he's never looked better. Killing it, finishing with the 360 flip down the 12 in his second run. He has been so good consistently for so long, it's amazing. Let's talk about how this run from Desenzo might stack up against Vincent, Yuto, Deshaun, Gustavo. I mean, he 100% is definitely going up into that, one of these top three spots. Uh, you know, this big section, the flip tricks down the, the stairs are scoring really high, so I don't know, it's gonna be close between him and Yuto. Looking forward to finding out. But you don't think it's up to par with Vincent. You don't think don't, it's up there. I don't know if it's going to pass Vincent, but it's, yeah. 8.5. You nailed it, Sean. That's good enough for third place. That ties his highest ever line score in Street League after all these years. He's going to have to look to his next go. All right, Desenzo coming off a great line score. is on fire. That is three skaters skating that gap to Hubba. Okay, Sean, kickflip crook versus kickflip front nose grind versus tray flip 50. Yeah, so kickflip crook is definitely more of the basic trick out of all those three. He is coming from the top, not off the bump, but he did it really well. And it is a kickflip crook on a big obstacle. You know, it's going to be a good score. I don't think he's going to be in the club with the other <laughs> two guys, but... But up there. Yeah, up there. Definitely a smart score. Yes. Yeah. Oh! Eight seven for the Dragons. Two more tries. Now, Ryan Desenzo. He's in seventh place. A 1.4 better moves him into fourth place, but that's probably not a score it's gonna hold. He's gotta do something huge. we've seen from Desenzo since when? This Honestly, is awesome. a long while. Not even warmed up anymore. Honestly, that probably is one of the hardest tricks of today. Kickflip front side, nose one side from the side like that. So you think he's up in the nines? Easily up into the nines. Look the at how well he did it. Up and over and to keep a nose one side like that. Wow. Look at how vertical his board was, too. Like, that was such a proper nose blunt. Yeah, that was wild. Nine point three! My second nine ever. That was huge. Did he just say that's his first nine ever? I think he did. There is another look. Wow. No it matter could not have been done better. No, 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 no. Desenzo on fire. He's in second place. 